to another edition of Farming Simulator 2017. Uh, this is Jim and I'm at uh, Cherry Hill uh, map by Stevie. Um, 2000, uh, Cherry Hill 2017. I don't know if I said that or not, but it's by Stevie. Duh. And uh, we all know the um, the winds and the, the house for this map and, um, and everything. So I'm not going to get into that, but uh, what I am going to get into is uh, this is a kind of a bittersweet day for me, for a lot of us actually. Um, this will be the final, the last one, the, the last map that Stevie gives, gets for us. Um, there's a lot of reasons behind it. Um, a lot of us know what the reasons were. We're not happy with it. We're not happy with the, how it all came about and why it had to be, get to this point, but uh, I guess it's just a ongoing problem in the modding world. Not that I'm that aware of um, of it because I don't do any modding myself. But anyway, on onto the map. There's a lot of things that are on this map. There are on a lot of other Stevie's maps, so I'm not going to get into the details of how and why on a lot of things. Uh, I'm just going to show you the the the. Uh, the enormity of this map. If you're familiar with this map in uh, 2007, 2015, I'm sorry, um, you know how big this map is. Um, huge, man, huge. Um, okay, we're going on fields forever. This is field every end. Oh my god, look how big this field is. Well, anyway, you get the picture. I like wide open. I like uh, wide open farms. I like wide open fields. Um, this is pretty big. <laughs> this is pretty big wide open. Uh, but again, I'm just going to show you how, what what the map is like or what's on the map. Um, pretty much the same as uh, a lot of the other, like I said, a lot of other Stevie's maps. The, big, the huge silo uh, with the electronic message board there, load board. Uh, the silage maker there. The uh, almost said goat. Uh, the uh, big forage machine. Now, uh, um, I got goats in the house. Uh, TMR total mix ration. Uh, compost machine. I've seen three or four of these within. Uh, on this map, so does that show you all kinds of what you need for the rest of compost you need? Yes, yes. Back door to the one of the map or one of the fields there. Seed masters. Um, right off the top of my head, I want to say four, but there might be five or six. To be honest with you. Um, <clears throat> making your own seed saves you a lot of money. A lot of money um, as I found out in 15 but I found out more in, in uh, the last game 2000 or well in, that, in 17 on uh, um, in some of the other Stevie's maps and I just was never one to, to get along with the seed master but now I do I can save you like a hundred thousand dollars a day <coughs> excuse me the sinuses are bothering me well sinuses and the weather what can I say so that's the uh, the farm area here and of course chickens over here now if we cross the road by the way this is Jones farm established 1894 elevation 3016 I think that's the same elevation as all the other maps huh. and established the same day too oh well anyway animals across the street Moo cows, daddy, moo cows. Uh, sheep with the uh, the bales will come out here and it can be moved back here to automatically sell. And on further down is, is the uh, are the uh, pigs. And um, they're more on line like the, uh, the uh, uh, sheep area are, you know, with your feed here, feed and water here and uh, straw over here yeah, but a little bit better looking area a little bit more modernistic looking 
Uh, water, let's see, uh, free water again, uh, that's prevalent on uh, a lot of Stevie's maps. Um, so you don't have to pay for water, which is kind of a smart thing to do because I, you know, in real life, that's, that's, that's the way it is. So anyway, that's the, uh, that's the animal area across the street from the, uh, from the uh, main farm. Just to give you an idea how big the, big the area is. Those are the fields. And I believe um, with one of the, um, something Stevie made a comment on about the other day was that the, um, it took 15 hours to uh, seed one of the fields, and I'm not sure which field it was, uh, to seed that field with, with one of the things that came in game. So, um, you know, you're looking at, um, you got a DLC, a big bud coming out on May 9th, um, which, you know, this is right in time, right in time, guys, because you're going to need something that huge and that massive. Now, I know there's a lot of mods out there that are 50, uh, 50 row uh, corn planters and stuff like that. But uh, I got a feeling that these are the quality and of, of the DLC is going to be better. So uh, you're going to need bigger implements and bigger cat fat tractors um, to pull everything here. So main farm right in this area right here. You'll notice along the edges. <coughs> excuse me. Um, a lot of mills. And I'm not sure. A lot of storage areas. Um, I think the mills, well, I'm not really sure exactly how, how these really, really will work. Okay. This is the, uh, this is where you sell your, uh, this is new. I, I didn't know this was down here. Um, so your, uh, wood chips. I'm getting old and also your your logs here so regular old sawmill here um, and up the road here is another I think this is okay this one will let you uh, load you know storage in here and then load to the trains here now, one thing I didn't notice, whether or not, yeah, you can load to your truck to another tractor. Okay, trailer. So that's just, that's the east side of the maps. Um, you notice a lot of things are named for people who've who've been um, especially videos and stuff like Puma Plow and and uh, Marhu and and that's you know where Stevie gets a lot of his um, ideas for. Uh, stuff to put on the game and where he gets gets them actually <coughs> and then um you'll notice you notice they're named after after people he knows so anyway so going up further um there's a digester here now you know about this one where you sell silage or whatever here and it makes silage or it's digestate here and um, that will make your fuel which I've saved a lot of money just just on this right here um, not only can you sell it and make a decent mo decent money off of it but you can also uh, fill all your vehicles with it not, at no cost um, that's lifesaver that's money saver Fertilizer again, saving money by using this to on, in your cedars uh, to fertilize your fields as you're planting, and then uh, of course the digestate goes in here. But over here is your liquid fertilizer. Put those in a sprayer, fertilize your fields. The only cost to you would be um, the cost of hiring a worker to do it to, to uh, lay this, this the spray out. Uh, storage for uh, well, that's seed and uh, fertilizer, and, or that's liquid fertilizer there, I think, and diesel there. I said that was seed. 
No, nope, that's fer liquid fertilizer. This is fertilizer, and this is diesel. Like I said, I'm getting old. I'm getting old. So, um, that's this part of the map down here. A lot of areas that you can... Um, here's, the, here's where you sell your animals. Again, this is something I, I didn't find the first time I was... Well, actually, this is the third time I've been on the map today. Uh, but that's where you sell your animals. I bring them to the market to sell. <clears throat> if you were to do this over, you know, just uh, um, by running, driving around this, you'd be here all day. Up in the upper right-hand corner, upper, upper north, um, is Jeeb's Mill. No surprise here. Uh, fertilizer uh, sales and and um, you can sell sell trigger there. Um, this has been sort of like a catch-all place, kind of a cool little place. I've always enjoyed Jeeb's. Uh, so anyway, going up here to uh, Andy Shipping is a, is a trigger. Uh, then Ray's Hub is another trigger uh, storage area. On down this way. Here is the, now let me see if I can get here without, all right, we'll visit the compost sales. This is the, this is the garden center. What I was going to show you was this area right over there. That is the, uh, your dealer area. This is the garden, garden area, garden store. Uh, another seed master over there, and but over here are your greenhouses and again water compost manure uh, will get you uh, what is this um, lettuce well, this is cauliflower here I can't see what I'm looking at cauliflower uh, tomatoes all that kind of good stuff automatically sell you know all you have to do is to maintain the uh... now how did I leave that I'm the only one that's been on the map so I must have So anyway, on this side, across the road from the garden center is another is the BGA. Now this is different from the digester area where the BGA has the silage um, areas right in through here, uh, where you bring your chaff and compact it down and it turns it to uh, silage and which you can sell or use it to feed animals actually also. So uh, storage areas, um, this is where you get your digestate from over here on this corner. And over here I missed, missed it. This is a manure maker, straw, liquid slurry here, get manure here. And I um, believe that a compost. Oh yeah, there it is right there. Fertilizer, uh, manure, or fer liquid fertilizer, fertilizer, and, and gas also, just like at the uh, digester area that you know, we read earlier. So that is right around this area here. The, uh, you know what, actually, We're just going to walk up the road. We'll run up the road, kind of. Uh, buildings here, buildings there. Um, statue here, all hailed. Uh, let's see. Um, this is the uh, spinnery. This is where you bring your palace of wool if you want to do it that way. Uh, which is silly because you have a uh, automatic cell place down there. This is where you bring your fuel to sell. This is also a good area to get your fuel. Uh, you sell back here in the back. Good way of making money. Baseball field is back. Um, again, a lot of a lot of open areas. I'll show, there's there's quite a few open areas. Well, a few open areas uh, to put uh, other businesses in. This is the bakery. Yeah, this is the bakery here. Another sell trigger here. 
house was right down in the middle of it. And this is the, like the downtown area that was in the uh, other maps. But over here is another sawmill. Now this sawmill, of course, there's the trigger to, to unload logs. Uh, this is Bill's joinery. You, know, they, you get, uh, you make, um, uh, let's see, pallets and the crates and something else here. And you got Taffy's tables here. That makes tables. And again, the wood goes right in here. Logs go in here. There's a sail trigger around here somewhere also. I'll let you find that. I think it's over in the corner here. Nope. It's around here somewhere. Well, you can find it. Um, but, you know, if anybody knows me, knows that uh, it's all about me. Everything's about me. So you see in, on the map some of the things that are that are made, you know, named after people. Uh, Puma Plows, you know, of course, uh, he does a lot of videos for Stevie's Maps. Um... Oh, I don't know, a couple of the other guys, uh, Moose down here, Marhu, and, and uh, all that other kind of stuff named after people. But like I said, it's all about me. So when I saw this here, I know it's not me, but I see Jim's timber supplies. Well, that's, that's me. <laughs> no, it's not, but it's me, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> oh, there's the sell point, as a matter of fact, for your logs. See, I am good for something. I am good for something. So anyway, that's the northwest part of the map. <laughs> There's also a place over here where you can... Um, There's a dairy here to sell your milk. If you think you have time to do something like that, you won't. Um, a lot of other, the, the bulk places to load. Now you go down here to... Um, this is Bill's too. This is kind of cool because um, here's the wood chipper down here on this area. And uh, you have Bill's joinery again somewhere. I swear to God it's here. Okay, it's not. It's made a liar out of me. Oh, there it is right there. I was just looking through. <laughs> I was just looking backwards. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. Let's listen to Jim's videos and and, and show, let's let him tell us exactly where's everything's at. Da. Okay. Bill's joinery. Uh, then the pallet manufacturer over here. You know, that's when you bring in uh, wood chips here and wood on the other side, and you get pallets of boards like this, and then they go automatically down here and they sell. <coughs> Excuse me. So, that's that. Um, good money makers. Good money makers. Well, you know, I really don't know how much money you make out of it, but enough that uh, you want to stay busy, you want to keep, keep doing it. So that's down in the um, southwest part of the map, sort of kind of in the sort of southwest. Um, see what you get down here, the liquid fertilizer sales down here. <clears throat> that's this one here uh, if you remember from uh, 2015 uh, this was um, greenhouses down here uh, but it's now let's see liquid fertilizer sale here uh, a seed master yeah I think I think six is probably more like the number um, over here on the side is the seedling uh, sales uh, you know, water, manure, compost, the, the three big three. And uh, that'll give you tree saplings on pallets that move down and sail right there. Just like in the, his other maps. His newer maps, anyway. And um, the gold coin challenge is, is around. It's still going on. I forget how many I've got. 25, 22, 23, 24, something like that. I don't know. So anyway, that's the map. Um, 
the map, the field fields are pretty much almost identical to um, Farming Simulator 2015's. So anyway, we're back here at the farm, the main farm, and that's the map. Um, again, I hope you enjoy this. Um, I know you'll enjoy the map. <laughs> I just hope you enjoy the video. Um, um, again, uh, kind of a sad, sad day. I'm kind of glad to see this map, but uh, sad to see Stevie. This is the last map that uh, Stevie's going to be making for us uh, because every new map that he has done, whether it be uh, uh, some of his 2015 maps, he always seemed to just add a little bit more to it to where you wanted to start a new map again. So, um, um, I think uh, the he said the uh, Facebook page would still be around, so he'd be there to check in every once in a while for support issues. Um, also, the... Um, the Google Drive will be down, I think, at the end of this month, or maybe the end of next month. I'm not really sure when his subscription runs out. So if you need any files or anything like that, from the way I understand it, it's going to be at uh, PC, the group, our PCSG, our, uh, the group that, um, that I advertise in all my videos, uh, the group I belong to. Um, I believe all his, all his maps and mods will be on that site. They have a mod area also. So um, check us out on PCSG. Uh, Stevie be around there. Uh, probably not as not as um, not like it was on his Facebook page. So, uh, but he still be the the files will still be available. Uh, so. Um, Thanks to Stevie, we really appreciate it uh, for what what all you've done for our, for our uh, farming community in this game. <coughs> Excuse me. You have made this game uh, such a joy, such such so enjoyable to to, uh, to play. We're gonna miss you. So, uh, guys, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. And uh, I really do thank you for watching. Big Bud's coming up here May 9th. I, I will definitely have a, uh, another video on reviewing that. Uh, so I've been looking forward to this map uh, for a long time. With the exception that uh, we're going to lose Stevie. So thanks, Stevie. Thanks, everybody. We'll talk to you later. Bye.